Good afternoon. Today is Wednesday, August 24th, and I'm a little anxious and nervous or whatever, stressed because my um, mortgage payment still hasn't gotten to the mortgage place yet because I looked this morning at my bank and it wasn't there. I kind of figured it wasn't going to be there yet today, but I uh, never helped to look. <laughs> and But my um, HOA payment is pending because I paid that yesterday online. No more credit for that. <laughs> Bummer. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep looking and I'm really hoping it gets there because I don't want to pay again. <laughs> um, though this time it'll probably be what I usually pay and not a little bit extra. <laughs> um, she did say that if they got the check and I paid by the time they got the check, they will send the money back to me, which is nice. But I would, I said I would just turn around and mail it back to you, <laughs> you know, <sighs> fun times, fun times. And this stuff always happens to me. Nothing good ever happens. And if it does, it's not often. So, I decided to go out today. I wasn't planning on going out for the rest of the week, but I decided to get my mind off of it, at least for a little bit. And you can see, I took two of the three envelopes that were HP empty ink cartridges and mailed them back. The only reason why I didn't take that one is because I couldn't reach it. And the um, Uber was coming, so. And I did a thing. I got a mailbox. I brought the cash that I got from what I sold Tuesday that helped pay for this. <laughs> um, so I'll put the address in the description box and also in the About Me tab on my YouTube. And I'll probably post it on my Instagram, too. So, now I can get happy mail. Um, it was a little pricey for my liking. For three months, it's $90. And then, to, and a $20 um, setup fee. So, it was like 110 Like I said, I pay cash <laughs> for it. So, we'll see how it goes. Um, you know. How much mail I get in three months, <laughs> you know, if I decide to keep it or not. But, yeah. And then I went to Winco. I was going to go, I was almost going to go to Trader Joe's first, but I really didn't need anything there. So, I went to Winco. And I didn't spend a lot, or get a lot. There was no fresh fruit or vegetables in the house. It was like the frozen stuff which is fine but um i wanted to get another almond milk i got cottage cheese i got um mandarin oranges Ooh, that one looks horrible <laughs> um more eggs i got mini cucumbers i'll probably cut up some and put it in in here like i did the last time to make pickles and then i got um tuna poke they have it, but not very often already cut up. So I can get my sushi fix <laughs> without having the rice. And then I got broccoli and cheese tots and zucchini, garlic, and parmesan fries. Thought those be interesting to try. Yeah, it'd be better than cauliflower, mashed cauliflower or cauliflower or anything. <laughs> I got bananas, I got almonds. I got um, another box of the dandelion, roasted, dan roasted dandelion root tea. I've been drinking it a lot, well, practically every day. <laughs> I don't know if it's helping, but. And they finally have these back. So I got one of the Starbucks, uh, the Starburst all pink. As you can see, I got plenty. <laughs> It's not like I like it or anything, but, and, uh, oh, 
and then I was going to say that's it, but I got a bottle of Dawn dish soap because I was running low on the little bottle. And then I got Arm & Hammer laundry booster because the other box that I had got ruined when my sink leaked because <laughs> it was under the bathroom sink. I got it because I want to do the laundry stripping of that denim shirt that I got at Goodwill. And I got a couple bras that I want to <laughs> strip because they're all sweaty and icky. <laughs> so, And then I went to Trader Joe's. I wasn't going to, like I said, but I want to see what their produce looked like. And it was just this expensive. But one co. as one co for strawberries and blueberries. But I got apples. I got uh, honey crisp. And I think I forget which one this is called. I have to look at the receipt. And then so I got one to try. And then I got the apple plums. And that's it. I spent seven dollars and sixty-seven cents at Trader Joe's that I paid cash for. <laughs> I could have paid cash at the grocery store, but I didn't because <laughs> I want the cash for it till yeah, I, I want to keep the cash that I have for a little bit longer. So, yeah, that's it for right now. Like I said, in the description box, I'll put the address to my, the uh, UPS store. And um, I get a discount with um, printing, packing, and shipping. And I asked if I got a discount off postage stamps. And he's like, he goes, no, 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 no. I'm like, darn. <laughs> and they're a little bit more at their, at UPS, the postage stamps. So, because I pay like $14 online. So, Thankfully, I don't need to order any stamps because I've been pay paying most of my stuff online because of the price of the stamps and because who knows where the check <laughs> checks are. So anyway, that's it for right now. See you guys later. So it's about 10 after 3 and I got the mail. This is not all the mail I got. I got my electric bill. Well, the statement I get it taken out automatically save a stamp and I got another harvest edition of olive cocoa Kellogg I was surprised to see this but I'll take it um, I wasn't too sure what image to take from the front cover either this one or that one but yeah I don't have to, I don't have to decide and I got the National Geographic X private private jet expeditions so that'd be fun to go through and on youtube i went and added my address in the about page well my um ups box and i added it in the default in the description box so every time I upload a video, you'll have it. And I try to add it to my artist page on um, Facebook, but I, I don't know why I didn't take. And I don't know why, but I joined Linktree. I got the free version and I added, I'm, I don't know why I got it. I'm not that big, <laughs> you know. Not that popular, but I added my YouTube, my TikTok, um, Facebook artist page, and Instagram. I think that's it. So, so yeah, um, that's about as interesting as it, it's going to get today. Oh, I meant to say this earlier. We're getting a um, grocery outlet. Here in Vegas, um, in a couple weeks, it's nowhere near me. It's like by Blue Diamond. And I looked on Uber and Lyft just last night 
just to see how much it will cost and it was not cheap <laughs> but and it's supposed to be like cheap, really cheap groceries. And I was looking at the, their sales ad and I'm like, wow. And I'm hoping they have a lot more low carb stuff that's cheaper. I just wish it was closer. And I think I said that in a, I saw it on my local Fox station on Facebook. They post about it, posted about it. And I made a comment about it being too far, which it was closer. And somebody commented, I don't, I think it was the store's owner or somebody there. But anyway, she said, yeah, there, there's going to be like four throughout the valley. So yay for that. And I'm kind of wondering if one of them is going to be in Boca Park because they've been doing stuff for a while, but I doubt it. Um, but yeah, that'd be really good. I like Winco, but lately it hasn't been that cheap, <laughs> you know? Um, and I really wish Aldi would get here, will come here. <laughs> Because I know they have low carb stuff because they're they have, I've seen it on TikTok and stuff. So anyway, that's it for right now. I'm gonna upload this and get to editing. So see you guys later.